This week on News Wiz 2018, Babar Bilal Malik and Ali Sadik representing Delhi Public School, Srinagar. Riti Kumar and Bhavna Pandey representing Mata Day School, New Delhi. And Sriram Madhavan and Paul Binu representing Bharatiya Vidya Bhavan, Vidya Mandir, Poochati Trisu. As always, it's cool, it's compelling, it's cutting edge. It's India's only national news quiz for schools. Let's play News Wiz. <laughs> Hello everyone, I'm Rajdeep Sardesai and for many of us, our romance with literature began with detective fiction and tales of Holmes, Poirot and Byomkesh Bakshi. A lifelong love affair with reading sometimes culminates in a dalliance with quizzing. And before you know it, you're going steady. And if our bright young quizennials stay steady through the course of this quiz, they have a chance of winning all this today. And before we put our contestants under the scanner, let's turn our lens towards this week's super sharp news guest. Please welcome my colleague Prerna Kaul Mishra, Managing Editor, Social Media, India Today Group. Welcome. From the world of Twitter and Facebook, you're in the world of quizzing. Yes, I have all the shares and likes to send their way. What is your advice to these young quizzers? Can they turn to you as an expert guest or not? I'm as much a learner, but I am going to give my best today to help you out. Social media is about the young. These are the young, so you know exactly what they want, their needs, their way of working, right? I learn from them, Rajdeep. My conventional journalism is over. They are my teachers now. That's a great way to look at life. Give her a big hand. Now from detectives to deer stalkers to sleuths since stockings, we've come a long way and so have many of our contestants. Culled from every corner of India, they're what makes Newsways the heady mix it is. And we've got six more sensational school kids with us this week. First, from the land that truly exemplifies the line that heaven is a place on earth, please welcome Babar Bilal Malik and Ali Sadik representing Delhi Public School, Srinagar. <laughs> Babar, what can I say? Welcome back. You and your team were in the semi finals last year. Are you ready to take one leap further and win the contest this time? Of course, it's a pleasure to be back, feeling quite at home and looking forward, as you said. What is it that has changed in this one year for you? Are you more experienced, more ready? I'm told you want to be a lawyer in life. I am, let's say, deeply passionate about law and public speaking in discourse. Uh, additionally, another fact is that, is that uh, in Kashmir, many people uh, who are in urgent need of legal help do not necessarily get that. So, uh, especially the poorer sections who have suffered the most. And it would be a moment of great pride and honour if I were, was to in any way be able to help them to serve my people out there in Kashmir. That is what I aim for, that is what I aim to achieve in the future, inshallah. That's wonderful and I can see that your hairstyle has changed. You've become more trendy, I see. <laughs> That's one thing that many people notice, sir. Ali, you're a debutant on the show and I'm told you're also fond of law. But before that, you're fond of something else. Tell us about your dreams. My childhood passion is aviation. But uh, in aviation, there is a thing, there is a specific age limit as to what you can apply to become a pilot. So I want to do that first and then maybe explore my secondary passion of becoming a lawyer, maybe in the aviation field. Give a big hand to the two young men from Srinagar. <laughs> and they're joined by Rufeda Shafat Kirmani, the psychology teacher and their activity in charge. You're also back, ma'am. Welcome to the show. Okay, let's then turn to our second team today. 
from a town that doesn't claim to be divine but certainly has a lot of heart. Please welcome Riti Kumar and Bhavna Pandey representing Mater Day School, New Delhi. <laughs> Riti Bhavna, welcome to uh, News Wiz. Riti, Thanks, you're like me, I'm told you like butter, butter chicken. Chi yes, sir. What is it about butter chicken that makes you so fond of it? Well, uh, the gravy. I like the gravy. When you're not eating butter chicken, what are you doing? Well, I'm watching football. Who's your favorite football? Diego Costa. You like Diego Costa, Atletico yes. Madrid? Yeah, he's my favorite. You like muscular men, I see. Yeah, the aggression. You like Costa's aggression. Okay, <laughs> Riti, be aggressive on news, Wiz. Bhavna, welcome to the show. You yes. come from a family of doctors, I'm told. Yes, and sir. you and your father discuss medicine on the dining table. Tell us more. What we talk on the dining table is basically about brain and research related to it. So, uh, the current human as a race know only 30% of the brain and I want to research the rest 70 and explore it myself. Bhavna, Riti, give them a big hand. Okay, also please welcome their companions. Riti's parents are here. Welcome to the show, ma'am, sir. Also Bhavna's parents, the doctors are here. And their school teacher, Manisha Fernandez, their social science teacher, is also with us. Thank you for coming. Okay, finally from God's own country, please welcome Sriram Madhavan and Paul Binu, representing Bharatiya Vidya Bhavan's Vidya Mandir, Puchatti in Trisur. <laughs> what pleasure having two young men from Kerala. You've gone through tough times, Trisur in particular. The waters have receded, I'm told, Sriram. Yes. yes. Yes, now it's almost like a drought in Kerala. That's unfortunate, moving from one extreme to the other, Sriram. But tell us more about yourself. I'm told that you are a traditional quizzer even at home. My father was one of the best quizzer during his college days. And actually, in one of the television shows in Kerala, I got to match up against my father. And I won. Has he forgiven you for it or not? Well, yes. <laughs> And I'm partially proud and partially yeah, sad about that because kids won't get to win uh, money in that. Only the com competitors get it. Paul, welcome to the show. I'm told you, on the other hand, have a clear skill that none of us have. You play the mridangam, that wonderful instrument. Yeah. You want to show us how you do it? Um, yeah, for sure. Why not? Go ahead. No extra points for playing the Mridangam, but you must tell us, when did you learn this skill? I first started learning Carnatic music when I was three years old. Basically, I loved rhythm and whenever I hear a composition, I first look out for the rhythm of the music. So that's when I was introduced to Mridangam. So I started learning it in fifth standard and I've been able to pursue it for like four years. Wonderful to have you on the show. Give them a very big hand. And with the Thrissur's boys today, Please welcome Sriram's parents, Dr. Madhavan VP and Dr. Kavita KR, and Sriram's sister, Amiya Madhavan V. Welcome to the show. As well as Paul's mother is with us. Please welcome Litka Binu. All the very best because every good detective story starts with a murder, and every good quiz starts with a murderously good round. But are the questions easy? Well, not too sure about that, but the round certainly a bit of a killer. Strap in then, let's play our first round. We call it In The News. In this round on the buzzer, each team must select one set from the given news stream and try and answer all three questions it contains. Each question carries 100 points. The news guest can help teams with any one question. If teams get stuck, they can ask for the answer to be displayed again as an anagram. But then they can only get 50 points for that answer. Get all three questions without any additional help 
and you get a 100 point bonus. There's no negative marking and questions don't pass. Hands on the buzzer. Okay teams, hands on the buzzer. This is your opportunity to score big in the first round. All the very best. Let's take a look at your options. Bhavan's Vidya Mandir Puchati Trishur has gone right away for merger, FIFA rankings and ambassadors. Sri Ram Paul, your first question then for 100 points is on merger. According to a recent announcement made by the government, which state-owned bank is going to be merged with Dena and Vijaya Bank? Bank of Baroda. Bank of Baroda, you are shouting at me together. It's the right answer. Well done, 100 points. Well done, Bhavans Vidya Mandir from Trisur. Your second question then, Sri Ram Paul. FIFA rankings. Which team shares the number one ranking with France in the recently released FIFA rankings? Belgium. 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 Are you sure of it? Yes. Belgium is the right answer. Well done again. It is Belgium. Sriram is on a roll. Your third question and a chance maybe to even get an additional bonus on ambassadors. The lead actors of which movie were recently okay. signed as the ambassadors of a Skill India campaign to promote the Skill India mission? Sui Dhaga. Sui Dhaga. Sui or Dhaga or both? Both. Sui Dhaga. Sui Dhaga. Paul Sriram, you max that round. It's the right answer. You get 100 points plus an additional 100 points bonus. Lovely to see those smiles on air. You've really charged ahead with 400 points. Remember, Varun Dhawan and Anushka Sharma, who are acting in that film, have been made the brand ambassadors for Made in India's Skill India mission. Okay, the other two teams, DPS Srinagar, Mata Day School, Delhi. These are your options. Take a look. DPS Srinagar has buzzed Babar and Ali on presidential elections, resolution passed and regional connectivity. Your first question then on presidential elections for 100 points is... Ibrahim Mohammed Soli emerged victorious in the recently concluded presidential elections in which country? Maldives. Babar is saying Maldives with a look of certainty. It's the right answer. Well done. 100 points to you. Remember, he scored an impressive victory defeating the incumbent president Abdullah Yameen and scoring a bit of an upset victory in the island of Maldives. Your second question then, on resolution passed. Which state assembly unanimously passed a resolution recently to declare the cow as the Rashtra Mata or the mother of the nation? Uttarakhand. It is again the right answer. Well done, DPS Srinagar. Your third question, and you can then replicate what Bhavans Vidya Mandir Trisur has done by maxing this round and getting a bonus is on regional connectivity. What is the name of Sikkim's newly inaugurated airport, which is the first airport in the state? The Pak Yong Airport. The Pak Yong Airport. You're an aviation expert, yes. you say. Sikkim has been connected to India. It's the right answer, Pak Yong Airport. You get another 100 points bonus, so you're also up to 400. Two teams have got off to a flying start. Kashmir and Kerala. Let's see if Delhi can match up. Riti Bhavna, your remaining options. Okay, Mata Day School. Riti Bhavna have gone for Space Tourist, Cricket Record and Adventure Award. Your first question then for 100 points is on Space Tourist. Which company recently announced Japanese billionaire Yuzaku Maizawa as its first private passenger on a voyage around the moon in 2023? SpaceX. Riti Singh, SpaceX. 
sure of it. Yes. yes. It's the right answer. Well done. You get a hundred points. The billionaire founder of online fashion retailer Zozo will take a trip around the moon planned for 2023 aboard the forthcoming Big Falcon rocket spaceship of SpaceX. Your second question then for another 100 points is on cricket record. Which Jharkhand bowler created a world record recently by taking 8 wickets for 10 runs in a one-day match against Rajasthan? Shehbaz Nadeem. Preeti, you told me you're a football fan. And you're saying Shehbaz Nadeem. Your confidence is well placed. Right answer again. It is Shehbaz Nadeem. My God, we've got terrific teams today. You've got another chance now to also max this round. Get that additional bonus like the first two teams. Your third question is on Adventure Award. The crew of which Indian naval sailing vessel was conferred with the Tenzing Norgay Award recently? Tarani. What can I say? You kids are super kids. It's the right answer. You get a hundred points plus an additional hundred points bonus. Tarini, of course, is like you, an all-woman crew. And they circumnavigated the globe, the first Indian all-woman crew to do so. Tarini was indeed the right answer. Riti Bhavna, you've also got maximum points, 400. Guess what, Prerna? We've got three fantastic teams. They don't need you. Yeah, I feel very useless, but I love it. I love it too. You've got three teams that have maxed their round. DPS Srinagar, 400 points. Mata Day School, New Delhi, 400. Bhavans Vidya Mandir, Puchati, Trisur, also with 400. Give them a very big hand. Wow, we've had the most fantastic first round. Nine questions asked, nine answered correctly without even a pause. But it's time for me to take a deep breath and take our first break here. We'll be back soon with our Caliphs of Quizzing. Here's the answer then to last week's viewer questions. Stay tuned to this fantastic round of News Wiz 2018. We had asked which sports personality sold his stakes in the ISL franchisee Kerala Blasters on the 15th of September. The options were A. Abhinav Bindra, B. Leander Pays, C. Sachin Tendulkar and D. Vishwanathan Anand. The correct answer is C. Sachin Tendulkar. And the winner is Rajit Ghosh from Kolkata. Congratulations, you get a gift hamper from Milton. Welcome back to News Wiz 2018. Hercule Poirot was famous for his little grey cells and Sherlock Holmes for his pipe. But here on Newsways, whose brain is ticking away furiously and who's going up in smoke? Let's find out first with our scores, which are terrific at the end of the first round. DPS Srinagar, 400 points. Mata Day School, New Delhi, 400. Bhavans Vidya Mandir, Trisur, also with 400. We have a tie at the top because the teams answered every question. Makes you feel very inadequate. I am not feeling inadequate. I'm so happy. I'm so happy. Thank you so much for not using my help. That's right. They don't need your help, but they are terrific young quizzers, which is just what we want on our show. But let's now turn to round two. Because as every good quizzer knows, Sherlock Holmes never actually said, elementary, my dear Watson. But while that factoid may be elementary quizzing knowledge, our quizzer's knowledge of news and current affairs will have to be a notch above as they navigate our second round. We call it Top Story. In this round, we show you six questions related to our top story. Each team is assigned a question and they can try and answer for 100 points. Other teams can press the buzzer at any time but can only answer if the assigned team misses it. The correct answer on a pass could get you 100 points. But if it's wrong, that's minus 50. If no team gets the answer, we'll show you four possible answers. And all teams can buzz for a chance to answer. If a team answers a question at this stage, it can earn 50 points or lose 50 if it's wrong. Let's play. Okay, teams. Let me tell you what this week's top story is. All of you are smiling. 
neighbors. Sometimes they call us over for tea and biscuits. Sometimes they keep us up with their music. And sometimes we have to tell them to keep their dogs out of our lawns. Love them, hate them, berate them, but you can never ignore them. The constant flux in India-Pakistan relations is our top story this week. Okay, hands on the buzzer teams, you know the rules. The first question is to DPS Srinagar, Babar and Ali. According to Navjot Singh Sidhu, which geographical corridor did Pakistan Army Chief offer to open when he met Sidhu at Imran Khan swearing in ceremony? Mata Day School, you buzz, but DPS, the question is to you. The Kartarpur Saab Corridor. I'll give it to you, it is the Kartarpur Saab Corridor. It's been a long-standing demand to open a corridor from India to Pakistan to allow Sikh pilgrims to enter that country and visit the Gurdwara Darbar Sahib at Kartarpur. Mata Day School, New Delhi, Riti Bhavna, you are looking confident as well. Your question is, who was recently quoted as saying, Pakistan wants to bleed India with a thousand cuts, in addition to calling for another surgical strike? Bhavans, you buzzed. The question is to Riti and Bhavna. You want to take a guess? Imagine. Your time's up. Yes, Bhavan Vidya Mandir. Bipin Rawat. Bipin Rawat. Bipin Rawat is the right answer. Well done, Bhavan Vidya Mandir. It is indeed Bipin Rawat. The army chief was referring to Pakistan's policy of trying to hurt India with little acts of violence and intentionally fomenting violence and trouble in the Kashmir Valley. Okay, the third question then comes to you. The team from Trisur, Sri Ram Paul, you're on a roll. Amidst these Indo Park tensions, which body sent a circular to all varsities asking them to observe 29th of September as surgical strike day? DPSU buzz question is to Bhavans. University Grants Commission, UGC. As I said, you're on a roll. It's the right answer. Well done. The University Grants Commission did send this notice. Remember, in 2016, the Indian Army had carried out retaliatory surgical strikes on seven terror launch pads across the LOC after the URI attacks in Kashmir. The day marks the event. You're up to 600. The fourth question is to you, Babar and Ali. Which Pakistan minister was Sushma Swaraj slated to meet on the sidelines of the UN General Assembly, which was later cancelled? Mata Day, you buzz. The question is to DPS. The Pakistani Foreign Minister Shah Mahmood Qureshi. It is the right answer. Well done. The next question is to Mata Day School, New Delhi. An infiltration of an Air Force station at which place in 2016 led to India calling off bilateral talks with Pakistan, a stalemate that still continues. Havans Vidya Mandir, you buzzed. The question is to Mata Day. Pathan Court. Sure. Yes. You've taken a chance. You've taken a chance. You've taken a chance. It's the right chance. Well done. It's the right answer. <laughs> Remember, the 2016 attack on Pathan Court came only a week after the Prime Minister, Mr. Modi, had gone there and met the then Pakistan Prime Minister, Nawaz Sharif. You're also now up to 500. DPS Srinagar at 600. A chance for Bhavans Vidya Mandir to edge ahead. The final question in this round, Sri Ram Paul, is. Despite the ongoing political tensions, the cricket teams of India, Pakistan played against each other in which country in the Asia Cup? DPS Srinagar has buzzed, but Bhavans Vidya Mandir, the question is to you. UAE, UAE. You guys are on a roll. It's the right answer. It is indeed the United Arab Emirates. Remember, the event was originally scheduled to be held in India, but Pakistan's participation became an issue because of the prevailing political situation. So the event was switched to the UAE. Wow! We've again had a fantastic round of quizzing here. They're getting every question right. Because at the end of the round, these are our scores. Mata Day School, New Delhi, 500 points. DPS Srinagar, 600. Leading the way, Pavans Vidya Mandir, Puchatti in Trisur with 700. Give them all a very big hand. Wow, we've seen some remarkable quizzing here, but who's going to win this contest? Frankly, I haven't got a clue. Who will be acquitted of all the charges? Who's going to head for quizzing jail? Find out in the rounds ahead as we return to this fantastic 
episode of News Wiz 2018. 2018 Rajiv Gandhi Khel Ratna winner Mirabai Chanu is associated with which sport? The options are A. Weightlifting, B. Boxing, C. Shooting, and D. Wrestling. SMS your answer to 52424. Type whiz, space, and your choice of right option A, B, C, or D. You can also log on to www.newswiz.in and participate in the contest. Contest closes midnight 30th September. Welcome back once again to News Wiz 2018. The best detective in the world can't send a criminal to jail unless he or she has enough evidence to seal the deal. We, on the other hand, have more than enough evidence of the brilliance of the fine young minds that are on the show today. Just take a look at the scores at the halfway point. We've got Mata Day School, New Delhi 500, DPS Srinagar 600, and Bhavans Vidya Mandir Trisur leading the way with 700. A very high scoring news whiz today. Let's just take a pause and meet the companions and family members who've joined us. First, to encourage the young boys from Srinagar, once again with us is Rufeda Kirmani, their psychology teacher an activity in charge. Ma'am, you're back again, like Babar. I am, but a little bit nervous because it's really a tough competition today. I know, and what about Babar? He's been your great favorite. You've had a love-hate special yeah, relationship with him. still is. And this year, he is a kind of dominating for uh, Ali. And what about his new hairstyle? Is there a word for this hairstyle that you young people have? I'm not sure, sir. I just watched it on TV and thought of having one for myself. Tell us a little bit about Ali as well. Ali is a very generous and sober kid, but he sometimes takes it from Babur. Sometimes not. Okay, good. Let's then turn from there to the national capital. First, I want to turn to Riti's uh, mother, Dr. Renu Kumar. Tell me about your daughter. She's really charged up for this quiz. Yeah, I suppose pressure, under pressure, she works better. What has quizzing done for her? She's basically a shy and a timid person. But lately, because of this, she is opening up. Okay, let's then turn to uh, Bhavna's parents. Dr. Pandey, how are you? I'm fine. What is this that on the dinner table, as she said, you discuss medicine? Uh, I never encouraged her to go into the medicine because medicine is a very long career. But she's fascinated by herself, not motivated by me. That's a good way to be self-motivated. Wonderful team again from Delhi. Let's now turn to the two young men who are leading at the halfway point from Kerala, full of smiles. Dr. Madhavan, you're the quizzer with your son. You have quiz competitions. Yeah, that's true. We had uh, an episode in, an, in, a, in a TV episode where we had to fight each other. I had a really fantastic doctor's team, professional quizzes, and we lost to a kid's team. You for should me, be proud that your yeah, son has defeated you. I don't know what the other doctors felt like, but for me it was <laughs> real pleasure to lose to my son. Wonderful to have so many doctors around uh, today. We also have Litka Binu, mother of Paul. Ma'am, what's the secret of Paul's energy? He's a very independent child. Um, and helpful also. Good, but it's great to have you all here. Give them all a very big hand. <laughs> what can one say? It takes a quiz to lift the spirits sometimes. Remember, let's turn to the rogues gallery from all your favorite detective shows. That's the thing where you see a host of pictures and you need to match the criminal with the deed. There are no rogues on display here on Newswiz, but there's a similar principle at play. Let's play our third round. We call it match time. In this round, each team is assigned one question. You'll see five images related to one topic with eight possible options. Teams have 75 seconds in which to match all five images with their correct answers. For every correct match, you get 50 points. One team member can search the internet for the right answers through our Gyan portal. In the last 30 seconds of the challenge, you can ask for the news guest's help. If you get all five answers correct without the news guest's help, you get a 100-point bonus. Will you meet your match? 
Okay, teams, this is a potentially high scoring round. We'll see, Prerna, if they need your help at all in this round. But our first question is to DPS Srinagar Babar Ali. Match these 2018 Arjuna awardees with their sport. Who's going to the Gyan portal? Who's staying with me? I'll go to the Gyan portal. Ali, the young man, is going to the Gyan portal. Babar is with me. Okay, Babar, these are your options. Take a look. Pooja Kadian, G. Sathyan, Ankur Mittal, Smriti Mandana, and Rohan Bopanna. These are your options then. Take a look. Your time has started. Ali, search for Smriti the first Smriti Mandana three. for cricket. Smriti Mandana is cricket. Smriti Mandana cricket. Yes, sir. And uh, okay. Rohan Bopanna. Rohan Bopanna. Talk to each other. Tennis. Rohan no, Bopanna, tennis. Tennis. Rohan Bopanna, tennis. Search for the first three. Rohan Bopanna, Pooja tennis. Pooja Kadian, Wushu. Pooja, Pooja Kadian, Wushu, sir. Yes. And Pooja search for Kadian, the Wushu. Man. Search the name, G. Sathyan. Yeah, yeah. Quick. Wait, wait. Let's get the others done first. G. Sathyan, search the name. Ankur yeah. Mittal, shooting. Ankur Mittal is shooting, sir. Ankur Mittal, shooting. Yes, sir. Okay, I'll put it in. G. Sathyan. G. Sathyan, table tennis. G. Sathyan is table tennis. G. Sathyan, table tennis. You're entirely relying on, on Ali. Not, no, not on Ali, but the internet, sir. Lock Perfect. it, lock it. Perfect. Yes, lock it. Lock it, sir. It's all correct. Okay, lock it. Come on in. You seem dazed for a moment. Okay, let's see how you've done. Rohan Bopanna. You said? Tennis. Tennis. Is the right answer. Well done. Remember, he won a gold medal at the Asian Games in doubles this time. Smriti Mandana, cricket. She's the star of the Indian women's cricket team. It's the right answer. Ankur Mittal, one of the many shooters who's making this country proud. It is the right answer. Pooja Kadian, you said wushu, a sport that too many don't know about. You searched the net. Well done, Ali. You searched it right. It's the right answer. But then when it came to Satyan, you were struggling. Gee, Satyan, you Good. were dazed. Couldn't Come find on. it in the list. You couldn't find it in the list, but you went with table tennis. Yes. It is the right answer. Well done, you maxed that round. You get your bonus, 250 plus another 100 points. Well done to the team from DPS Srinagar. Okay, Riti Bhavna. Mater Day School, Delhi. Let's see how you do in this round. Your match time question is, match these current United Nations Security Council non-permanent member states with their capitals. Remember, the UNGA is on at the moment. Who's staying here? Who's going to the Gyan portal? I'm staying here. Bhavna is going. Okay, Bhavna is the one. The calm Bhavna is going to address the issue of Gyan portal and Google. These are your options. Take a look. Ethiopia, Bolivia, Kazakhstan, Sweden, and Equatorial Guinea. These are your options. Your time starts. Search all four. Adidas, uh, uh, the second one for the first, Ethiopia. Ethiopia for what? Adidas Ababa. Adidas Ababa. Adidas Ababa, Ethiopia. Yes. Okay, yes. I put it in. What are you searching for? Sukre, Sukre for Bolivia capital. Sukre. Sukre for Bolivia. Okay. Yes. Sweden. Astana for Kazakhstan. Kazakhstan Astana. Kazakhstan is Astana. Okay, put it in. Sweden. Stockholm Equator. for Sweden. Stockholm, Sweden. Okay. Search. Equatorial Guinea. Do it. Uh, Malabo. Malabo for Malabo. Equatorial Guinea. Go with Malabo? Yes. yes. Sir. Lock, it. Yes. lock it all in? Yes. yes. Equatorial Guinea, Malabo, lock it in. What happened there? You seem nervous suddenly. <laughs> Ethiopia. You said Addis Ababa. Right answer. Well done. <laughs> Bolivia. You used the help of the Gyan portal and said Sukra. Is the right answer again? <laughs> Kazakhstan. You said Astana. I'm afraid it's the right answer. <laughs> Sweden, I yeah. thought you'd get that straight yeah. away. Stockholm is the right answer. <laughs> you had the Stockholm syndrome yeah. for yes. a moment where you seem to struggle with that name. Equatorial Guinea, right at the end you said Malabo. Yes. 
Why did you do that? Because Google said it. Because Google said it. Google can sometimes get it wrong. I'm afraid. You've got them all right. Well done again. Good. The smiles are back. You've got 250 points. You get a hundred points bonus. You also get 350 in that round. Good, Bhavna and Riti. You've done very well. Okay. The young smiling boys of Kerala. Paul Shira. Let's take a look at your question first. Match these fighter aircraft manufacturing companies with the countries in which they were founded. Who's going to the Gyan portal? I'm going to the Gyan portal. Okay, Paul is the master of the internet. Take a look at your options. BAE Systems, RAC MIG, Dassault Aviation, Saab Group, Lockheed Martin. These are your options. Your time starts now. Okay, Paul, Google BAE Systems only. RAC MIG is Russia. RAC MIG Russia. You don't want him to Google anything. No. Okay, BAE Aviation is... United, United Kingdom. Kingdom. United Kingdom. BAE Systems, United Kingdom. Yeah, United Kingdom. Okay. Uh, it in. Dassault Aviation is uh, France. Dassault Aviation, you're saying put France. Okay. Uh, Saab Group is uh, Sweden. You don't want to take his help? I know, Saab Group is Sweden. Sure. And, yes. Okay, put it in. And Lockheed Martin is United States of America. Lockheed Martin, United States of America. Ah, now just Google everything, starting from Lock Sa Saab. You first have given me everything, now you are coming to him. No, I just want to check. Go ahead. Okay. Go ahead, okay. Lock it in, come on in. Let's see whether your confidence is justified, my friends. BAE Systems, you said United Kingdom. Is the right answer, well done. RAC MiG, you said Russia. The great MiG fighters of Russia is the right answer. Dassault Aviation, in the heart of the Rafale controversy, storm from France, right answer. The Saab Group, Swedish aircrafts, well done again. But then you went and said Lockheed Martin USA, without even asking Paul. Because had you asked him, you would have realized Lockheed Martin is indeed from USA. You get them all right. You match that round. You get your 350 points. Wow! You're a walking encyclopedia at the moment. Well done. Fantastic round of quizzing from all our teams again. Remarkable what's going on. They're getting every question right. And these are our scores then at the end of round three. Mata Day School, New Delhi, 850 points. DPS Srinagar, 950. But leading the score at the moment, Havans Vidya Mandir, Puchakti in Trishul with 1,050. Give them a very big hand. This quiz is as good as it gets. There's one more round to go before the quizzing jury in the sky pronounces its verdict. Who's going to go home in triumph and who's headed for the pokey? Find out when we return with the final round of News Wins. It's time now, teams, for that crucial round. It's time to put your fingers where the buzzer is. We've got something that has never happened in Newswiz in three years. It doesn't get closer than this. Welcome back one final time to Newswiz 2018. It's been a heck of a trial so far in this episode, and it's time for our young sleuths to present their closing arguments. Who's going to sway the jury? Who will be laughed out of court? First, the scores, please. Mata Day School, New Delhi, 850 points. DPS Srinagar, 950. Leading with just a round to go, Bhavans Vidya Mandir from Trisur with 1,050. Sriram and Paul are smiling at the moment, but remember, this round could make all the difference. Final words from you, Prerna, to the teams. They've not needed you, as I keep reiterating. I'm feeling so, so nice for you guys, and best of luck, give it your best. Leave the rest to God. That's right. I wish you all the best of luck, because it's time now, teams, for that crucial round. Abandon all talk of detectives, trial lawyers, and pompous judges in wigs. It's time to put your fingers where the buzzer is and make your case for a win. In our final round, this is the 500-point monster do-or-die round. We call it 
News Buzz. In this round, we will ask five audio-visual questions that are open to all teams on the buzzer. A correct answer will get you 100 points, while an incorrect answer means you lose 100 points. Questions must be answered the moment the buzzer is pressed. Otherwise, it's an instant minus 100. Questions don't pass in this round. All clear? Let's buzz. Okay, teams. Let's start then with the first question. Identify this movie from the trailer. Take a look. Today, school, Billy New Delhi. Rockstars. Yes. Village, Village rock stars. Village rock stars say Riti and Bhavna aggressively. You've done a Virat. There is the right answer. Well done. You're up to 950 as well. Village rock stars, remember, was the name of the Assamese film that is India's nominee to the Oscars this year. Your second question then. From this video, Identify the place in Italy where this event is taking place. Mater Day School, New Delhi, yes. Underground dance floor. Underground dance floor. You haven't even seen the video. We Take a look. Lake Como. Lake Como. Como. What was that going on? Uh, this is Anila uh, Mukesh Amani's daughter, daughter. Isha Amani's uh, engagement going on. That's right. With and I'm afraid friend. you got your answer <laughs> therefore wrong. Sometimes being Virat Kohli is a double-edged sword. <laughs> Relax. Don't worry. The right answer is Lake, Lake Como, Como, where Isha Ambani, the daughter of India's richest man, Mukesh Ambani, recently got engaged to her longtime friend, Anand Piramal at Lake Como, in Northern Italy. You've okay. lost 100 there. Remember, there's negative points, yeah. but you're still in the race. Yes. There's still 300 points to go. Relax. Your third question, my young friends, is which 2019 event is this recently released promotional song for? Take a look. I've had the highest mountains. I've had the deepest rivers. 2019 World Cup, Cricket World Cup. Riti, you're fond of football, you love Diego Costa, and you keep getting your cricket questions right. It's the right answer. Well done. <laughs> Riti, you're on a roll. The other two teams seem stunned at the moment by the girls from Mater Day because they are back to 950. But remember, two more questions to go. Identify this personality from the video. Acts of War. They caused at least 129. Franco is Holland. You said Bhavna? Franco is Holland. Francois Holland is the right answer. Well done. It is the former French president who's dominated the headlines when he revealed in an interview recently that the Indian government had allegedly proposed Ani Lambani's Reliance Defence as the offset partner for Dassault Aviation in the Rafale aircraft deal. You're now up to 1,050 as well. You are in a tie at the top with the team from Trisur. And DPS Srinagar, you're just 100 points behind. So you too are still in the race. It doesn't get closer than this. From this video, identify the country where this recently happened. Take a look closely. DPS Srinagar, yes, you Frankfurt, Frankfurt Germany. Germany. You said Babar Ali? Frankfurt, Frankfurt Germany. Germany. It's taken you the fifth and final question of News Buzz to wake up. It's the right answer. Well done. That is Mamta Banerjee in Frankfurt, Germany, playing the accordion with someone dressed as Mickey Mouse. Guess what? We've got something that has never happened in Newsways in three years. Three teams are tied at the top at 1,050. And that perhaps defines the kind of contest and just how brilliant you three teams are at quizzing. Each team is at 1,050, which means I have a tiebreaker question. 
that will go to all the three teams. Hands on the buzzer for your tiebreaker question. Identify the character from this recently released video. Take a look. But I cry because you're Marta Day? Uh, James Bond? No. I'm afraid is the wrong answer. The correct answer was the Joker. The teaser trailer of the upcoming Joker movie was released recently with Jokey Phoenix set to reprise the role of the iconic DC villain made famous on the big screen by Jack Nicholson and Heath Ledger, which means that you are out of this race. And we still have a tie between two teams, Trisur and Srinagar. Let's see whether it's Kashmir or Kerala. My final tiebreaker question. Who is being wished here in this unique style? Take a look. The team from Trisur, yes, Paul. Narendra Modi. Narendra You're saying Modi. Narendra, Narendra Modi. Modi. Narendra Modi. Narendra Modi. On, his on his birthday. Happy birthday, Narendra Modi. Sri Ram Paul. At a time when Kerala has gone through much agony, you've lifted the spirit, you've got the right yeah. answer! You win the quiz, come on in! What can I say? Babar Ali, you have been fantastic. Riti Bhavna, you were terrific. But it is the young boys the young boys from Thrissur have brought a smile on the face of their state. To our wonderful audience, thank you very much. Our fantastic news guest, Prerna, you were great. Give yourselves a very big hand. This has been a classic suspense drama today. As the smiles continue, let me just end by saying, Sansar ki har shay ka itna hi fasana hai, ek dhun se aana hai, See you all next week. Remember, news is knowledge. Thanks for watching the video. For more such news and updates, please like, share and subscribe to India Today. Also check out our other great videos from our channel, We Know You Would Love To.